My name is Hassina Bait. I'm the CEO of uh, Safon Energy, uh, which is a clean tech uh, startup, uh, Tunisian startup, uh, focusing on um, wind energy. I'm an ex city banker. I spent my uh, last uh, 12 years um, between Tunisia and uh, Dubai as a director of a local corporate uh, team. Uh, I recently came back to Tunisia two months ago to uh, overlook the Safar Energy uh, business, which is a startup that has been uh, created recently to promote a wind uh, energy patent that has been um, designed, developed by a Tunisian young uh, team, which is a big challenge for us. And uh, we said, okay, we don't have to miss this opportunity to prove to ourselves and to the world that yes, a small young team of Tunisian engineers, manager, can do something different and can really go, go ahead and dream of, 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 of promoting something new, innovative, that can make big change to the country. We come up with the idea, I mean, with a partner, I mean, which is old friend, my best friend, you know, he's an engineer, I'm a manager, a banker, I said, okay, we think that there is a great synergy here, if we team up, we can build something solid and we can do something different. And we started from scratch. I mean, uh, we uh, established uh, the first company uh, two years ago. I was uh, managing it on part-time because I kept my job. I was still in Dubai. My partner was here on the ground. He's an engineer, so he was developing many stuff. And it went really well because we felt this complementarity there is already a trust and there is already this kind of uh, chemistry between us because it's, it's this 20 year old uh, uh, friendship. I brought the okay, funds, I brought a, a connection, I brought uh, some strategic you know, uh, view, he brought technical expertise and not only that but turned out to be a, really, a real genius and in a couple of years, he came up with two innovative technology that has been patent, you know, locally and internationally. And now we are, for us, it's, it's, it's a totally new step because quickly we evolved from a startup that just started to a company that holding two international patents that needs now to start promoting worldwide. Uh, it was for us something uh, uh, more than uh, doing a business. It was a dream and it is a dream that we are doing our best to make it happen, make it true. We create uh, a company, the second company called Safon Energy, to exclusively promote one of the patents because, you know, uh, we are a small team, we are, have uh, limited resources, we said okay, we cannot do everything at the same time, we need to focus on one uh, thing. So we choose to focus on the second patent, which is wind technology. Uh, we think it's something radical and so it's, 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 it's something totally new. Um, so we decided to take the dream proceed with, with this. Uh, the name of Safon has a lot of, uh, has a symbolic um, meaning for us because Safon in, 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 in Carthaginian uh, legacy means wind and Baal Safon was the god of wind and you know the Punic war between Carthage and Rome and unfortunately Carthage, you know, lost but that's why Aeol, who is the Roman god of wind, took over and all the, um, uh, uh, the, the, the wind turbine, being called in French Aeolien, because the root is Aeol. So now for us the dream is to change this and instead of Aeolien, we're going to talk about Safonien.
That's a dream, but who knows? When we started, we had nothing to do with renewable. Okay. You know, we started something, something related to HSE, health, safety, environment, because Anis, my partner, uh, used to be uh, the regional manager uh, at Shell and then Schlumberger covering Tunisia, uh, Algeria, and Libya. So we said, okay, there is a lot to do. He can do it himself because he has limited resources and he's, uh, 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 he has to focus on the technical uh, side. Said, okay, let's team up. I bring some value, he brings some value, and then we do it all together. So the first six months, we were focused on HSE. Then quickly, I realized that he has a huge potential in terms of innovation, in terms of lateral thinking, in terms of analyzing stuff, criticizing many, many current you know, technology. I said, okay, probably there is something here to be, to be, to be done differently. We, he started developing some uh, a tailored solution for some uh, uh, um, industrial groups here in Tunisia to help them um, uh, improve their, their, their efficiency in terms of uh, uh, um, uh, energy uh, saving uh, solution. So, and this made a huge uh, success. And I said, okay, for sure now, there is a different strategic uh, 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 thinking that has to be an implemented. So quickly, we decided to put the, 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 the initial, let's say, activity, the HSE, on hold and focus exclusively on research and development. And that was a huge risk to take because uh, giving away uh, a stable cash flow and focusing on something which is cash burning with no cash in inflows, that was a big risk. I said, I'm taking the risk, I told him, don't even think about money. Uh, whatever cash flow gap at the end of the month, I will cover it. I w because I kept my job, I still have my personal cash flow at Dubai. I said, every month, he called me and said, okay, this is what is missing, and I worried it from, from, from my bank there. And we survived this way for 18 months. At the end of the 18 months, we, come, we, we found ourselves that not only he developed other you know, solutions, but he quickly turned to, to the energy sector, because this is his old background, and he came up with two, as I said, two new technology, one in wave energy and the second in wind energy. Said, okay, I mean, at the end, you know, you don't realize what you have, because said, how come where billion of dollars are being spent you know, worldwide by all the giants in research and development you know, for the last decades, a small team in Tunisia came up with something that might compete with others. I said, it's too, be, too, be, it's too good to be true. You know. But you said, let's explore, let's, let's push it to the next level. Said okay, we hired you know uh, uh, a legal um, a law firm uh, to uh, take care of all the the the, the, the requirement to uh, to submit and to register you know this uh, new technology and to, 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 to look for a patent to, to, to get a patent. It was something totally new for us because unfortunately in Tunisia we don't have the culture of you know research and development of getting a patent of getting things registered. There is very few uh, specialized lawyers for that. But we said, okay, we're gonna pay for it and we'll take the risk. So w we've been, let's say, uh, 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 compounding the risk because not only are the case risk of cash flow, but then take other risk to invest in something intangible with a big question mark because we have no guarantee that these things will, 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 will can work or not. Uh, in six months, we got two patents in hand. That was absolutely crazy because said, and, and not only that, but when we get the report, when we get the feedback from the WIPO, which is the World Intellectual Property Organization, 
because they, 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 they send us a kind of opinion. They do the international research to see if this technology does exist elsewhere, or if it's just you know an improvement, slight improvement on existing one, or it's something that have no 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 future. When we got the feedback, which was amazing, then said, ah, there's something here that can, can should be you know explored seriously. From that, we uh, uh, created, as I said, um, Southern Energy. We uh, we spent seven months uh, developing a prototype, you know, and that was one of the toughest things that I've been uh, uh, doing in, in my life because creating something from scratch uh, uh, in, 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 in a country has no uh, infrastructure that can help you to, uh, 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 to do this research and development and to, 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 uh, to build this prototype. Imagine most of the parts that we needed there were not available here. So we had to import many stuff. We had to adapt many other stuff that we have to because if, if you find, uh, you need a piece like that, but then you just, you, you find a piece like that. So you just, you, ha you need to find a way how to adapt the second piece to, 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 to replace the first piece. So that, that, that period was extremely, extremely exhausting to us uh, with this uh, 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 emotion, first of all, that you hold something, but you need to keep secret because you need to wait for 18 months to get this closed. So you have to hold it. And at the same time, you don't have to waste time. You need to progress on, on your, your prototype. You need to invest a lot of money with no guarantee, as I said. Uh, you need to, uh, with, with very limited resources. We don't have a lab. We don't have this uh, fancy material, you know, to do. We don't have this uh, laptop, this. Uh, so that was a challenge. And that was, I said, OK, we go for it. After seven months, we had the prototype. And it was amazing. It was working perfectly. You know, we did the test, and it's unbelievable. I mean, the kind of number, the kind of performance that we are talking about, it's, it, it's crazy. Uh, at a certain point of time, we were shy even to talk about this, because people will, 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 <laughs> will think that we are mad, or we are just uh, uh, the, the imposter or the, the, the but we have the proof now. I mean, uh, 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 we have a patent, we have a prototype, we have a presentation. This is now the second challenge, and the challenge is as important as the first one because okay, you can come up with something great, but the, uh, history tells us that there is many, many great things that have been created in the past, but never reach the level to be you know, adopted uh, uh, worldwide. So there is many risk, there is many uh, uh, steps to be uh, uh, um, crossed. That's why we, we, we did this first round with a minimum dilution to keep control of this and to proceed and to progress. You know. We are a Tunisian a team. Uh, here, the fact that uh, all of us are Tunisian, it's not because we don't want anybody else <laughs> not Tunisian to be part of it, but just, uh, uh, okay, because it's easier, it's, 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 we are, the, the, the company now is based in Tunisia, but again, to prove and probably to set a precedent and to inspire other Tunisians that said, yes, we can do, actually, it's, it's, we need to uh, decomplex because we've always been this complex of no, 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 everything related to technology, to innovation, all the great invention are always coming from either US or Europe or elsewhere. But we, we've always been a net, a, a pure importer of this technology. So we've never created something, you know, uh, uh, substantial before. I think now this is a chance, a chance for us as a company, for us as a country, for us as a region, to uh, try to somehow reverse this trend, start to work on reversing. It's not, it's not a fight, it's not a war against the other, but just for us to unlock this potential that has been for a long time, you know, banished there, put there. Uh, we need to 
get this confidence back, all of us we are human, and all of us we have a minimum of intelligence. You know, it 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 it, it requires a, a, a lot of hard work, a, a minimum sense of commitment and of responsibility, and building the right team that can gr get great synergy, and and that's it.